News Channel 7 is on your side. Well, here we are. We're trying to make it easy on you here at News Channel 7. 7 our Caring for the Carolinas team, our sponsors, Doctors Care, Hardee's, and, of course, Goodwill, we're all making it possible for you to donate uh, for the folks that are around the Gulf, Louisiana, and Mississippi that are in such dire need of a, a simple drink of fresh water at this time, food. Uh, we, we have some folks manning the phones. We want to thank in the last uh, half hour uh, the uh, chief of police of Greer for coming in. I'm going to talk to him in just a minute. Also, some of these folks include the, uh, the Everett uh, Powers, who is now the director for the Spartanburg Arts Partnership. He is down on the front row. We have some News Channel 7 employees volunteering. And, of course, the American Red Cross is here. Now, where else would you think money to a good cause would be spent more wisely than through the American Red Cross? That's what we think, and that's what we're all about. We're asking you to take that number. It's a toll-free. Pick up the phone. Give us a call, and we are looking for donations to help the American Red Cross help those that are in such dire need around the Gulf from this uh, Hurricane Katrina. Uh, New Orleans, now, they get all the publicity. Ninety percent of the town is flooded. Uh, people don't have fresh water. Uh, all the dead have not been found yet. Uh, people in Mississippi, uh, of course, uh, in dire need of some help at this hour as well. And they're trying to recoup in 95-degree heat, uh, which is hard in and of itself. Now, there's the phone number. If you would like to donate, and you can do it uh, several ways. Uh, money donations, you don't have to call us for that, but we'd like to hear from you. BB&T can handle that. Go by BB&T and uh, tell them this is the Hurricane Relief Fund that you saw on News Channel 7. They'll take your cash. That goes to the American Red Cross. Everything we're doing is coordinated through the American Red Cross. If you would like to send a check or a money order, call us. We'll give you that address uh, that you can mail that to. And thirdly, we will take your credit card, your debit card. We'll do that. Uh, we, again, have the, uh, the forms to fill out. You'll talk to one of these nice people. Call and ask for me, and if I can get to the phone, we'll talk. Uh, well, we need your money. How much have we raised? Well, we have a goal of $100,000 by 6.30 tonight. We are just up to under $16,000, but we're uh, getting there. We're going to make this, and you're going to help us. I've never seen such caring people. Some of these totals that individuals have called in is just phenomenal. I'm going to share some of that. We're not going to give names on the air, but uh, with this last call in, that total will have to go up another couple of thousand dollars to about $17,000. And uh, we've got, of course, hard to talk to folks on the phone, but that's, that means we're doing our job. Uh, Chief Dan Reynolds of Greer, the chief of police is on the phone. He just got a call in, and I'll share it with you guys, from Abbeville for $2,000. God bless you for that. This will go a long way. Trust me. Dan's on the phone. Let's see who else we can talk to. Well, they're busy. Uh, American Red Cross is here. And of course, they coordinate all the money. Let's, uh, let's uh, see if we can walk down the way here and talk to Mr. Power, see how he is doing. He is with the Arts Partnership of Spartanburg, and he is from Baton Rouge, Louisiana. He's getting a call, and this happens to be from Spartanburg, a $500 donation. Uh, we again tally these. We'll keep you up on the totals, but we want to hear from you. I don't hear the phones ringing in the back, so get on the stick. Uh, folks need your help, and the money will go a long way, especially since it's distributed through the American Red Cross. Now let's get back to our regular programming. Is that if only my medicine could treat and help prevent these seasonal nasal allergy symptoms. Only Nasonex is clinically proven to both treat and help prevent most seasonal nasal allergy symptoms, including congestion. Only uh, Nasonex. Side effects were generally mild and included headache, viral infection, sore throat, nosebleeds, and coughing. I have returned my flower, a change B. For seasonal nasal allergy symptoms, Nasonex is the one to treat and help prevent congestion. Talk to your doctor. Hmm. What should I make for dinner? I need to thaw the hamburger. Banquet Homestyle Bakes Pizza Pasta. Everything you need to prepare a hearty home-baked meal in five minutes, all in one box. So you can think about dinner less. Daffodils will be nice out front. And enjoy it more. Banquet Homestyle Bakes. More of what you want. And now enjoy three delicious new recipes, including creamy stroganoff and pasta. <laughs> Don't say I didn't warn you. New Moisture Extreme Lip Color from Maybelline, New York. Feel the difference. Moisture Extreme is packed with three times the power of the number one lip balm. So moisture goes deep down, conditioning goes extreme. 
It's our smoothest, most sumptuous color ever. Color this gorgeous, moisture this extreme. Should come with a warning. New Moisture Extreme Lip Color from Maybelline New York. Feel the difference for yourself. Maybe she's the Maybe it's Maybelline. Every home has a rhythm of its own. And now, finally, there's an air freshener that's in tune with it. Introducing new Airwick Freshmatic, an automatic spray you simply set at intervals of 9, 18, or 36 minutes. It delivers wonderful bursts of fragrance that keep your home smelling fresh for up to two months. New Airwick Freshmatic, set it to the rhythm of your home. Smooth, creamy jello pudding with real Sunday topping. Jello Sunday toppers. At 110 calories, you haven't enjoyed a Sunday this much since you were in pigtails. Jello Sunday toppers, now in caramel. Hi, I'm Barney, and that's my friend Ted. Meet me at the bar in 15 minutes and suit up. When I say suit up, I wish you'd put on a suit. I did, that one time. It was a blazer. I'm his wingman. I suggest we play a little game I like to call Have You Met Ted? No, 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 no. Hi, have you met Ted? Because I know the ladies. I'm from Bangladesh. Ooh, the women hot there? It is a picture of my wife. A simple no would have sufficed. How I Met Your Mother. Look at you, you suited up. This is totally going in my blog. CBS Mondays this fall.